We are not reporters nor journalists. The views, information, or opinions expressed are strictly and solely barbershop talk. We pride ourselves on being uncut, unapologetic, uncompromising, unfiltered, and refuse to conform to anything less than. So if you can't, cut the cap. This ain't the show for you. Listen, people got to stop getting caught betting, man. <laughs> Folks, I mean, I know Tani wasn't prosecuted for it. He got, he beat it. But you got to stop gambling on a sport that you win, man. Like, that that's a that's a conflict of interest. We like, spoke about this. The humans can't, bro, as humans, we can't help it, bro. We just, they didn't mess us up, bro. Fan do sport, uh, all the sports better than mess us up. We about to be in a lot of trouble, bro. Sports ain't never going to be the same, bro. Listen, he bet that his team would lose, though. Absolutely. If you know you were a bunch of losers, you like, yo, we go lose. Let me put this hundred thousand way, bro. I know you suck. I put this hundred thousand way, bro. He said, like, I see y'all shooting in the gym. <laughs> he got nah, great insight. Nah, all, right. all right, so listen. <laughs> just to give a little more context, so this is Michael Porter Jr.'s brother. Okay. Okay. He played for the Toronto Raptors. Well, he used to play for the Toronto used Raptors. To. Raptors. <laughs> he used to. He used received, to be a used to. They gave him, he received a lifetime ban. That's ugly. That's uh, tough. How do you get banned NBA. from the NBA, bro? You know what I'm saying? So he's done. His career is finito. Wow. You know what I mean? Mm. Yo, but hold on. The nigga's smallest bet was 15. His large bet is 22,000. His net winning was 21. Bro. I made more than that nigga. Yeah, that's crazy. <laughs> that's crazy. I'm not going to lie, though. Bro, how is he? What do they do? Are they betting on a computer? Like, on but a... This is not, but check it, though. But this is according from their investigation. Okay. It oh. is according to what they found, you know, Holy on the counts. Shit. He had to do, you know, like, they tied yeah, yeah. him to. Yeah. So he wasn't, he was, he was, obvious, he wasn't betting from his job. He has somebody else betting for it, type shit. That's how awesome. can they prove that? that way? That's tough. Yeah, but how, right? How can they prove that? Uh, I mean, they they proved it clearly. <laughs> so, so do I, I'm. A, this is my guesstimation. I had whistleblower man. Yeah. Oh right. yeah, this is my guesstimation. He sent ten thousand to this person. This person put the bets on. Yep. Yep. They traced the money back. Where'd you get this ten thousand from? Because you don't make this money. That's, and that's, that's how they happened. trace the best back. I mean, this is what we're talking about. You know, there's always a trail. You know what I mean? Yeah. But, um, People got to be smarter, though. That's crazy. But it was wild, You got to give it in cash, man. First of all, Max. first of all, shout out to Michael Porter Take Jr. Take this duffel real quick. Man. Listen, shout out to Michael Porter Jr. He a good brother. You know what I'm saying? He tried to hold his brother down. Before, you know, when this first came out, he was like, nah, my brother ain't doing all that. Y'all bugging out. Y'all just trying to put shit on him, allegations, blah, blah, blah. I'm right. positive he ain't going to risk his career for some shit like that. I I wonder where Michael Porter Jr. stands now. I hope he I hope he's <laughs> they probably checking him right now. they like, oh, let's check his accounts. Right. Mr. I'm pretty sure he not cheating. Mm-hmm. Let's check That's your accounts. Know what I'm saying? But, yo, he even went as far. Check this out. He went as far. As to so uh, apparently they found a transaction where it was for eighty one thousand dollars. Okay, it was a bet for eighty one thousand dollars that he basically would underperform. So he basically was going to get under- what? So this- in this game, he he all of a sudden he he got sick. And he didn't play. So he played in the game. Yeah. Mm-hmm. He played three minutes and then they took him out. He ain't played the rest of the game. Wow. Uh, the bet the bet was bringing back one point one million mm. off of that eighty one thousand because mm. of the odds. It's crazy. <laughs> so now nah, he's worked, bro. That's nasty work, bro. And they felt like it was funny money. Like they felt like, yo. Know what I mean, so they froze the <clears throat> bet, and uh, that's when the investig that's part of the, how the stupid. investigation, I guess, started going about. That's stupid. Anthony he, Davis next. Yo, he should have stayed in the game and just didn't play good. Like, what the heck? 
That stuff. I'm saying you know how to miss. If you know how to make a shot, you know how to miss. Yeah, a but shot. now I, I think they're gonna play the game no bad. That you, big, though. you don't want bad right. stats because you still got to get your contract. You still got to be on the team. So nah, but, if you play sick, then you can get your bad stats, but you also didn't play. That looked but bad though. Any bet yeah, that remember big, on, they gonna look at, bro. Yeah, and remember oh, on one bet. Once you start the game, the the the, the bet is live. Yeah. So yeah. even if a player get injured two minutes it's into over. the game, yep. you're done. Yep. It's over. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. that's tough. I guess that was his way of trying to, you know, finagle the finagle. But he don't even play a lot of minutes though. It's not like he a starter. Yeah, so Yo. as you can see now, I mean, apparently part of the investigation they found thirteen bets that they directly tied him into. So question. Wow. Question, because we might be sitting on something right now. Mm -hmm. What if one of us made a bet with him involved on one of them games that he did that shit and we lost? Can we sue that nigga? <laughs> Oh wow! Nah, nah, nah. nah. Why not? Uh, he did something illegal. That is kind of crazy, though. Yeah. No, I'm, I'm, I'm sure something in the underwriting of the betting is, is that's the rest of it. I'm sure there's something no. in the underwriting. Nah, it did, it did, for one, I've never. Say, I don't know. I, I'm say, just getting... There's no way in the world they're gonna say if one of the NBA stars bet on themselves, you can't get your money back. That's not gonna be a writer, Bob. But they, right. they never. But they, hold on. But it that's happened. They, the betting part of it, they never paid anything out. Which the person mean? that's be betting on themselves and doing all the legal shit, they always get in trouble. The company uh, that actually well, holds yeah, the bet has I never paid nothing back out. Because ever. I don't think nobody was smart to ask the question. I just dad's going to cut the cat. And the reason I'm thinking, because you know they got they got lawyers too, is something in that underwriting or something that we press click click here and then they get all that shit that we didn't read poppy says whatever you bet you got to take the risk as is and that covers a lot of shit that I, i'm assuming so next time we go to FanDuel or mgm we got to look at the terms and conditions no, really that that shit shit. Probably say, whatever's presented is what you betting on regardless <laughs> of what gonna, happens i'm gonna get a lawyer nigga i know i better on one of them games he's a part of <laughs> that's crazy yeah, yeah, yeah. better on, on this, you, on this man. Up real quick. Yeah, you said you better on this man what game was that? Yup, I bet it on that nigga right there. Yup, this nigga the average so four point four yep. points. Ain't no way, yep. yo, bro. He's an idiot because why would you do that? Like you could have easily like, right. you know what I mean? Throughout the the out the out the season, you know what I mean? Bro, and he only got one year of experience. He's bugging, bro. He threw his whole career away. He could have been scheming for ten the whole time, bro, on a low. Oh man, he was probably making more money betting than actually playing. <laughs> Yo, that is crazy, bro. Yeah, that's probably what it was, Bash. He was bringing whole more checks from from MGM than his, his NBA. Career. Nah, ain't no way. That can't be possible. Yo, listen. Even at a minimum salary, they still making a, at least a mil. Yep. In a year. Let's see. You know that shit. All public documentation. He said, according, he earned two point three million over three seasons. So divide point two point three million by three. That's crazy, bro. He's an before idiot, bro. tax. Yeah, he's an idiot, bro. And like we saw earlier, he only had a, a profit. I mean, because remember that was a profit. Yeah. He only had a profit of twenty one thousand betting. So that's crazy, crazy, bro. He made you risking you risking all that seven hundred thousand a year. Twenty thousand. Yeah, he made seven hundred seven hundred and sixty-six thousand a year. See you later, buddy. That's tough. Yeah, he made seven hundred thousand. Yo, it's crazy because this, but I this guess dude in his one big year play was going to be that one point. Yeah, yeah, he goes yeah, out yeah, of there. Yeah. yeah. I I <laughs> wanted to lick. Oh, well, hold on, we gotta. I gotta. He thought he I caught wanted, a lick. 